Jeez, yeah. So when you talk about yeah, the prophet, you have to know about his prophet peace and blessing be upon him. Prophet Muhammad peace and blessing be peace be upon him. Yeah, you have to know about his family as well. And you need when you ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you have to praise and bless the Prophet and his family. And you have to glorify Allah and you have to praise and bless the Prophet's family and you ask for what you want and then thank Allah for everything he's given to you. Confess for your sins, repent and promise you won't repeat them, then ask for what you want. Because that's a better way of your dua being answered. Now yeah, you have to know yeah that when you when you ask for forgiveness, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala yeah, will ease you up nicely, trust me. So keep on asking for forgiveness no matter what the situation is. And you have to have that like, good moments with your family and that and spread knowledge like I said here. Yeah. And you have to know here. Yeah. You have to have as much knowledge about the deen yeah, and just spread it as much as you can. And even if you haven't got no sins, you have to repent and know that Islam is about good manners, and that's why the Prophet came down to make people have better manners. And there's a saying here: yeah, if you if you hope that you're going to live tomorrow, yeah, then that means you've got hope that you're going to live forever. That's how it is. That don't don't think. Oh, you don't know if you're gonna live tomorrow. And if you be good to people, yeah, people will like you. And that's how it is. That's that's that's, that's the way of life. When you be nice to people, people like you. And you have to know. That all your food, your money, your everything comes from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And know that in heaven there's going to be rivers of, of yogurts and milk and all of this stuff. Which just tastes beautiful and so you want to make it to heaven you just got to follow the Quran and follow what the Quran says as much as possible. And you have to just think about the creation of Allah as much as possible. And you have to fear only Allah. And only get angry for the sake of Allah. And keep thanking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And be persistent when you're asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And put your trust in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as much as possible. 24-7 film it so astaghfirullah rabbi wa tubu alayh for everything that I've done and just keep praising the Prophet and his family Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad the best actions here yeah, just keep on praising the Prophet and his family Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad blessings and peace and blessings and praising the Prophet and his family and try and give out as much water as possible that like people that first to give them water and you have to love the Prophet's family as well and just know, know what time and just your kids have to be trying to teach them to pray and praise Allah and have as much friends that are believers go to the mosques as much as possible and love Allah so much and just stay indoors and worship Allah stay in the mosques and worship Allah as much as possible and spread the word, spread the message and just, just love Allah more than anything 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 in the world you gotta love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala more you should love Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala more and just think of the creation of Allah and the beautiful creation of the universe how magical, miraculous and glorify Allah and, 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 
and if you if you love something then you're gonna remember it more so if you love last man you're gonna have remember him if you love anything you're gonna remember that thing so remember so loving Allah that means that sh to show that that means you gotta keep on remembering Allah and and know that the Prophet peace be blessed Muhammad peace and blessings be upon him yet yeah, is more love to Allah yet yeah, or more more love to Allah than every creation he's created in the angels and the earth and the universe and my prophet Muhammad peace and blessings be more love the most love creation to Allah feel me um just know she got persistent out here, yeah, keep on asking Allah, pray and pray and pray and keep on praying, don't don't stop praying and keep remembering your grave and whatever happens is mashallah, so it's written. Ask Allah to keep guiding you. And if any time you're in a fight or anything, just keep remembering Allah subhanahu wa name. And And have knowledge of the deen. Have knowledge of the deen. Straight. The more knowledge of the deen you have, the better. Um. Every second, yeah, you gotta be thinking about your death and what's gonna happen after you die. And just keep asking, keep asking, ask thousands of times for things you want. Don't ever stop asking. And give as much advice as possible. Because there was Prophet, peace and blessings be upon him, saw a man. And he said, you're the people, you're one of the people of heaven. And they found out that that man he said that to was the man that gave the most advice. He always giving advice. Also, whether you're in big problems here yeah, or you're just relaxed here, yeah, you should be the same. Don't go, don't, don't let things change you. smile at your brothers in the masjids and stuff and just cry as much as you can at night um, or in the daytime keep on praying ask for forgiveness and and you know the pious believers here this it says their eyes was always crying yeah and their night times was like day times because they was just worshiping Allah all night yeah and, pr and and fearing him and asking for forgiveness and their day times was like night times because obviously they were tired from the night yeah so they were just in, they were also at home during the day just praying and stuff but it's like their night because they're like just sitting down and that praying and that you feel me um yeah so you just gotta got know, you just gotta know, yeah. You have to thank for every blessing you've got. You have every single bit of your eyes, your nose, your ears, your head, your being Muslim, being alive, being take, breathing, everything. You just gotta thank for each one of them blessings and just think about what's gonna happen after you die. And you know that the ants and the, 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 the creatures when you die they're just going to eat your flesh and stuff and it's the only thing that's going to stay is your soul and you just got to know yeah you just got to keep increasing your knowledge increasing your good deeds increasing your iman and your belief in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as much as possible because there's no limit to how much iman you can have and there's no limit to, there's no limit to how much good deeds you can do so you can go on for, t for long for long for real you can go on for long, you're doing as much good deeds, as much, much good deeds as possible. So, it's no.